everyone, today I'm going to show you how I organized under my kitchen sink. This is something that I have needed to do for a while and I'm glad I finally got it done. So let me show you what I've done. Okay, so I use these metal bins. Um, I have one here for my trash bags. I have one over here for my daily cleaners and daily use. And I have one back here for my stove cleaners. Now I got these metal baskets from Michaels and I only paid $1.99 each. I was tipped off by my girl Misha um, at just some ideas on Instagram that Michaels was running a 90% off sale. So I'm going to put her information below because um, you really should follow her on Instagram because she posts some really great deals. So now I have this, I have these uh, containers here that I got from the Dollar Tree that I'm holding my sponges, my stainless steel um, scrub pads, and um, I'm basically putting things back, back under here that I don't use that often. Now the sponges I, I put at the front because I'm going to use that more often than the others, but these things are items that I don't use probably every day. Now over here, I have these glass containers with the silver top. I got these, I actually thrifted those. Um, I know that Target does sell those, um, but I thrifted those from the Goodwill. And um, I'm holding my baking soda because I use baking soda to clean my sink. And um, I have some more scrub pads because these two things I use more often uh, to clean my sink. Okay, so in this clear container, which is like one of the clear shoe boxes that you get from the Dollar Tree, but I actually got these from Ross. They were five for five ninety nine. Um, I keep my dish rags in that, and I actually just changed out all of my dish rags because if you have dish rags that are getting ratty and dirty and, and and torn, just go ahead and get rid of them and replace it. It'll make you want to be in your kitchen more and to clean more. <laughs> Okay, so in this basket, this, these are the things that I use on a daily basis. I have my Myers dish soap and multi-purpose cleaner, and I have these di these tabs that you can put inside the sink if your sink starts getting a bad smell, and it makes it nice and fresh. It's a lemon scent. I keep my dishwasher tabs over here, and my and my um, and my rinse in the back. Now I don't know if you guys ever had Myers before, or if you ever used it, but it smells amazing I have the honeysuckle It's definitely worth a try and I'm not sponsored by them or anything <laughs> now back here in the back I have the items that I don't use as often so I have the barkeepers friend I have the um, cooktop cleaner and then I have the oven cleaner and then I also have this um, other uh, cleaning paste that I also use on my cooktop if it gets really really dirty so um, these are items that I don't use every single day. And then in the very bottom, I have my silver cleaner. So I have my Wright's silver cleaner and a couple of sponges. Okay guys, so on this side of the door, I have my cleaning gloves hanging on this command hook. Um, and I'm just using a binder clip to hold that on. And then I have this over the, over the door bag holder. And this was a great find. I got it from Burlington Co. Factory. It was only $6.99. And it just keeps those bags under control. Because if you're just throwing bags under the sink, it just quickly becomes a huge mess. And so um, I love having this. Okay, the final thing I want to show you is, you know how you have these dummy drawers right in front of the sink? Well, you can have a Reva shelf installed in here just so that you can have some extra storage space. And you can pick this up at Lowe's or Home Depot. I would like to thank you all for watching and I will see you in the next one. I'm going to be organizing this entire kitchen. So I will see you then my friends.